Six Steps to Entering Into His Praise, Songs for the Summer. Good morning. I'm at Cal Expo this morning, and this is the weekend for the final opportunity to go to the California State Fair. As I was reading on my morning prayer walk, Psalms chapter 100, I was pondering what it means to enter in. I am so close to the front gate. I drove about 25 minutes to arrive at the gates of Cal Expo, but I haven't entered in. Being on the outside looking in isn't on the inside. Many people open up their Bibles and they go to church and they sing songs, but do they really enter into the presence of Almighty God? King David gives us six steps to enter into his presence. I love reading, and there are many inspirational books all about entering into the praise of the Lord. I have a shelf loaded with books on worship and praise. But I want to encourage you that these six steps come from the Word of God. Inspired by the Holy Spirit, King David gave to us Psalms chapter 100. Six steps to enter into his presence. Number one, know who God is. Know that the Lord, he is God. It is he who has made us and not we ourselves. We are his people. We are the sheep of his pasture. For me to enter in to Cal Expo, I have to go through these gates. I have to purchase a ticket, and then I have to go through security. When we speak of entering into the presence of God, we discover that David reveals to us that the first step is knowing who God is and who we are. We belong to him. He is the Lord. We did not make him. He made us. We belong to him. We are his people. We are the sheep of his pasture. Step number two is David would always begin singing. Faith comes before feelings. And sometimes you may not have a melody in your heart. Sometimes you may not feel like singing. But there's something about music, there's something about singing that from the inside it begins to transform us and we pass through these gates into His presence. Number three, as we know who God is, as we begin to sing and worship Him, you'll find yourself even shouting. Make a joyful shout to the Lord, all your lands. And number four, serving. Now for me, this is key, and, and it just opened up a whole experience of worship and praise. When I go into a homeless camp and I minister and, and I share food, water, and, and ice in the heat of the summer, when I am serving with my hands, when I lead hope hikers, young people that have a desire to follow the Lord and, and to know Christ deeper, when I am serving Him, I've discovered I begin to move into His presence. And number five, thanksgiving. Enter His gates with thanksgiving. This is the most well-known portion of Psalms chapter 100. But I want to point out to you that it begins with knowing who God is. It begins with singing and shouting and serving. And we are transformed into a place of thanksgiving. And finally, number six, and into his courts with praise. David wrote, be thankful to him. Bless his name for the Lord is good. His mercy is everlasting and his truth endures to all generation. 
Psalms 100. In just about another hour or so, there'll be so many people here. The parking lots will be full. There'll be long lines where I am standing. And people will move from the outside to the inside. Jesus said that you enter in one way, and that's through the Son, the Lord Jesus Christ. In Psalms chapter 10, Jesus, the good shepherd said, I lay down my life for you. How do we enter in? We come to the Father through the Son, the Lord Jesus Christ. We know who he is. We begin to sing. We begin to shout. We begin to speak words of thanksgiving and praise. Almighty God, we lift our voices right here at the entryway of these gates at Cal Expo. Wherever we are, we worship you. We give you praise and we give you glory. We thank you, Father, for another day. We thank you, Father God, for this beautiful morning. And just like Cal Expo, this is the last weekend and then the gates will be closed. And here on earth, we can praise and worship you today. But there is coming a glorious day where you will come for your bride and we will be transformed, we will be changed, we will be taken up into heaven where forever we will praise and worship you. In Jesus' name, amen. Sing, shout, thanksgiving, praise entering in to his presence songs for the summer psalms chapter 100